Quist. I'm a forage fish biologist with the Fish and Wildlife Department. I've worked for the agency for 11 years now, uh, doing herring surveys. Herring are an indicator species in Puget Sound, and lots of things eat them, like orca whales, salmon, and seabirds. There are about 20 different herring populations in Puget Sound, and we, we take small zodiacs and stop every two to three hundred yards along the shoreline and we throw our, our spawn rake overboard and we rake up the vegetation that's close to shore. When we pull up the rake, we assess the amount of eggs or no eggs that are on the vegetation and with that we can calculate the total adult biomass of herring in Puget Sound. So the old, the old methodology of surveying for herring was we would, uh, we would use a paper form, a GPS, and um, we'd have the, the person in the bow using all that, all that stuff. Now with the uh, iForms program, the GPS and the form is all integrated into one application. So it makes data processing much easier. It saves, saves plenty of time when we get back to the office and there's no chance of, of losing the data once we get it back to the, once it goes up to the cloud. In the old system, with the paper form and the GPS, often we would uh, we would find data entry errors in using Excel to enter all that data from the paper form. We would inevitably lose files or uh, GPS files, uh, paper maps. There's there's lots of moving parts to that process. Uh, but with this I form, it instantly gets shot up to the cloud, and we don't have to worry about losing data or data entry errors because the, the person in the bow is, is doing it real time. On average, I would say it saves saves every survey. Well, we do 100 and, about 175 surveys a year. It saves about 15 minutes per survey. And then it'll save me for processing all the data at the end of the season, probably at least two weeks of combining files and getting everything all all into one one usable database. As far as my job goes, the field work process is from about mid-January through uh, mid-June. We're out, I'm out three to four days a week in the small boat looking for all the places that herring spawn in the state. The rest of the summer and into the fall is spent processing the data, which with this iForms program is will be greatly reduced, I believe. And then um, I help out a little bit with some other projects to fill out the rest of the year and get ready for the next season that starts again in January.